Let's look at this segment, MN. I want to find the midpoint of this segment. Well, the midpoint means it's right in the middle. What might be a good way to find the middle of this segment? Oh, yeah. We learned that when we draw, well, construct a perpendicular bisector, that it splits the segment into two equal parts, and that point that it splits it at must be the midpoint. So again, notice I'm opening my compass. It needs to be more than half the length of my segment. I'm going to start down below point M, and I'm just going to give myself a nice smooth arc. Now, keep my compass the same setting. Turn it around, come here to N. Come down below, draw this nice smooth arc with my compass. And now I have those wonderful points of intersection above and below. This creates kind of a cat's eye. Now I'm going to use my straight edge. I'm going to line it up with those points of intersection. Draw in a nice straight line. It creates a 90 degree angle. It creates two segments that are congruent to each other. And I could call this point in the middle A if I wanted to. And I know that point A is the midpoint of segment MN. I also know that segment MA is congruent to segment NA. They are of equal length. And I know that angle A creates a 90 degree angle.